hey guys how are you guys doing it has been ages since i checked in on this channel i know i know i know the pandemic and everything has just been messing with my mental health but i woke up today and i was like you know what i'm not going to wait till i feel happy to do things i'm just going to keep moving and that is what i'm about to do today so i'm going out with my friend we're just going out but i think we're going to do a bit of shopping and some extra things here and there so yeah we'll be carrying you guys along and i don't know i kind of feel good about this so i decided to make it into a vlog let's see how this goes see you guys soon They sell attachments. Yeah. I see Brandon Are you serious? Yeah. I see Brandon Nelson. Yeah. Play is something like. Play is playing. Just think playing. Playing good. Playing. Playing black. Yeah. And anything or white? White. Playing now. Okay. White. Only this one. This black is good. Uh, this one. My tumbler. This one. Okay. This one. Yeah. This one. Yeah. This one. Yeah. This one. This is the finest here. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, they have nice no, yeah, no. things. Okay, I don't, know if you, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but <laughs> people complain that I'm not talking a lot in my vlog, so I'm trying to. I'm going to try today to talk a lot more. So I'm heading towards Sunday market, which is usually held on Sundays, but now it's held on Saturdays in the pandemic and lockdown and everything. So I want to see if okra is back in season. Okra has been out of season for months. I think during the winter, okra is usually not in season. It's usually in season during summer and although we're still in spring, but it has started getting quite hot. So I'm just heading to the market to check if it is now in stock. And I hope you guys can hear me. And I'm getting shy because I'm outside. <laughs> but yeah, let's go. This person should have that orange thing. Now these raisins. Yes. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Raisin? What's this? Cranberry. It's sweet. Cranberry. 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 Yeah. This raisin. Hey, which one should I get? I don't know. I've never had any before. Hey, put it on, put it on. Too sweet. Too sweet. <laughs> I want to get for bacon. Ah, I don't want to put my marks. But even natural. Like mm, natural but dried. Like natural. Like natural. Yeah. Like sugar cane. Okay. Like this. How much? For 70, one kilo. How much? Uh, no, I don't want kilo. <laughs> five, five. Hey, put it on, put it on. Hmm? That's one or two. <laughs> Come there. You don't have it though. Mm. Yes, please. Hello. You don't have it. Good. Good. Fresh. Yes, fresh. Why did you throw stone? Say you're sorry. Say you're sorry. No. Say sorry. You're laughing. Literally, like, 
think what the thing missed me, if you know not. Not the camera would have caught them also throwing the thing. Yeah. Oh, you, you want to throw again? Yeah. You are lucky you are not in Nigeria. Try it. Try it. Try it. Can you see this stone? This heavy stone that this small child. Try it. Try it. <laughs> Literally, like we're just walking, and the guy, the small boy, asked us for one lira. And I think because of our last experience with them, we just ignored it. He get and as we're walking, the guy picked up a stone from behind where he was sitting and threw it at us, and he missed us by an inch. <laughs> Give them the money. There's always problem. It's always problematic. They get upset. I've not seen such entitled people before. Walking to come here, but. They are closed. No, I'm using mine instead. <laughs> Take all of them are quite pricey today. Some days they have cheap pots, some days they don't. I just need one I can be using for my <laughs> cooking videos. So that's what I'm doing. Hot. The skin is burning. I was not even started our uh, work for today. <laughs> still have shoes but most of the time the shoes are out of stock
Mm -hmm. Similar to the one I'm carrying. I love that bag. I love love. Okay. Both my budget, but I'll come back for you. <laughs> the accessories. in Cyprus when I'm shopping I usually like shopping from mango <laughs> it's funny I usually like shopping from mango because I'm kind of sure of their quality they're like the only store I can kind of really trust that if I get something from them it's not going to wash or just fade off very easily unlike some other stores closely followed by cotton this one's a hello I'm good. Yes, I can. Those are designed for women. I don't know. They are really nice. Try. Which shape are you looking for? Chuck Guzel. So tired. I'm so tired. Hello, Abby. Please, are you free? Are you free? Can you come to Cotton Dairy Boy? Cotton, Cotton Dairy Boy. How many minutes? Okay, Abby. Okay, Abby. Waiting. Thank you. Bye. Now we need to 
speed shop. <laughs> I like this one, so how much is it? It's gone. It's not bad. Mm, let me check these are party dresses. Okay. Cute. I actually need underwear. I need to focus on shopping. I'll show you guys what I get when I get back home. <laughs> Bye. I plan to like arrange and everything but that's not gonna happen because I'm fucking tired <laughs> I'm already in my position for rest and rest I shall <laughs> I need to figure out what to eat Chad, then maybe after eating I'll have the energy to unbox or unpack and I'll show you guys where I go okay This shorts. I should probably try it out, but I'm so <laughs> yeah. So I got this set of bracelets. If you guys can see it, yeah. I'm going to try if one would work as an anklet because I've been looking for anklets. The one they had in the store, I didn't really like it. But I'll try that out later. I got this one because I got the blue one the last time I went shopping and <laughs> it fits me so well that I was like, you know what? I need it in that color. The fit of the blue one was like really nice. I think I should probably try this out. I hope I picked the right sizes and I got this ruched top now that I think about it I have a top in this color I should have probably picked a different color color cute right it's evening so the sitting room is dark um, I got this top <laughs> I hope because of Corona, I cannot really allow to test. The uh, changing rooms are locked, but you can return it if it doesn't size you after testing at home. So I really don't see the point of it. <laughs> I got this. I just like the material. It's very light. So I got this t-shirt. Gray. I don't think I have any gray. Okay, I have gray t-shirts, but I don't have this shade. So I got it. I got it. I don't really like high neck t-shirts but let's see i got this cut out boob thing t-shirt yeah yes to be honest cotton gets me i got this black shirt because i feel like i don't have any black t-shirt right now most of my black t-shirts have washed out because cypress stores are useless so i got this one the fabric isn't like your typical black t-shirt i don't know if you guys can see it it has a bit of ruching on it if that is what it's called i got this basic <laughs> basic vest thing that i can wear on days when it's like really hot and i got this gown to be honest i don't know if i might return it i'm going to try out the clothes if there's anyone i don't really like i would go and switch it out for something else it is nice, but the fabric kind of looks cheap. <laughs> but I like it. And then I got this. This dress here, yeah, I love it. But they had like an orange, bright orange one in the store. And I feel like that would have been more of my style. Because I like brighter colors. But they didn't have it in my size. And the gown's already like a large gown. So yeah, can you guys see it? Yeah, so that's all I got. And I'll be trying it out, but I don't think I'll be testing it on camera because I'm fucking tired. And I don't even think I'll be testing them out today. When I'm arranging my room, which is definitely not today, <laughs> I will be trying them out. Can you guys see me where it's random or where they're me? See ya. I'll see you guys when I see you guys.
chat is where it should be. <laughs> Ciao. Hey guys, good morning. How are you guys doing? <laughs> um, it's today is a what I don't know. Anyway, I kind of woke up with a little bit of energy, not too much, but enough to know that I have to use it for something good. My house is currently really scattered, and I want to organize. Should I show you how scattered it is? Mm, okay, I think I will. But I'm just going to show like. <laughs> So I need to organize the sitting room, my kitchen, and I've already started arranging, like I've started, first of all, like I've wiped down my, my, um, my cabinet area, I wiped down my fridge and everything, so now I need to like ensure that everything on the outside, I've ensured that everything on the inside is clean, now I need to ensure that everything on the outside is clean, and that takes me a very long time. I'm, I also need to sweep and mop and I have some shopping that I did the other day that I have not organized so yeah so as you can see messed up because I slept there <laughs> I have some clothes that I have to wash I have some shopping that I need to organize I have some debts that I have to take downstairs I have to arrange here I have to wash those ditch dishes. I have to wash this. I have to clean this microwave, which I'm currently doing. I just put some water and some soap to help loosen up the things, and I'm going to clean it up. I'm going to put it on for a bit again. So I just wiped down this cabinet in and out. I wiped the inside, arranged everything, and I wiped the outside. It's not so organized, but yeah. So, so I just organize that a bit that's what i'm dealing with and when i'm done i will let you guys know to be honest my room has been disorganized too but i don't think i'm going to get into that today unless i have the energy but yeah i'll show you guys when i'm done i was so f i was so tired yesterday that i could not really talk that much i actually planned to end this vlog yesterday but i was so tired so now we're just entering a new day you guys are going to see what i get up to when i'm alone <laughs> yeah so hopefully my house is organized today when my house is organized i myself i'm usually disorganized so if my house is organized today and everything from tomorrow i can start like my full routine back and i think like my life will just get in order basically so yeah i'll see you guys when i see you guys <laughs> I just swept now, so I'm about to mop, and then I need to break this coconut for some fresh coconut milk. And yeah, I'm not really going to show you guys all that, but I'm just going to show you guys when like, the meal is done. Oh my ego! Oh na na! Oh my ego! Not for you! Eh, eh. I'll see you guys later! I have to take out this trash now so i'm going to take it out and i need to break some coconuts downstairs and yeah so i'm still cooking hence why this place is like this I have like some dishes to wash and i need to wash this but yeah i'm making curry sauce so my friend is going to help me break the coconuts downstairs because i'm using coconut milk and yeah chicken is ready i should probably start boiling the rice yep. so yeah my house clean, a pool one. This grout color has changed. I've scrubbed it. It is not green in me, and I really don't know what else to use. And I'm just like, you know what? This is not my final destination, so I'm just leaving it. But I've tried my best. That mop, that brush thing. I try not to use brushes and mops for a very long time, so I think this is over there. I need to change it. But yeah. Apart from the dates that needs to be thrown downstairs, my house is clean. Clean. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so, I'm just going to eat, relax, open my project. 
I'll show you guys what I make before I sign out finally. Okay? So, coconut looks rotten. <laughs> I don't know if I should use it, but I, know I don't really like taking chances with food. <laughs> it looks soggy and rotten, and when it was broken, there was no water in it. So I think I'm just going to skip on the coconut milk and just make plain curry sauce. Hey guys, so I was about to kind of end the vlog. In fact, I think I had already ended the vlog, and then I was trying to shut my mind off it but really i just couldn't and i think this is something that's been on my mind yesterday on tv and i think it is just important to put it out here there was a young girl in nigeria that went searching for a job and somehow somehow first of all she put out a tweet looking for a job and someone said that's an opportunity to to and someone said there's an opportunity to plan to hurt her and not only did they hurt her they ended up raping her killing her and burying her in a shallow grave now i don't know if that is not wickedness really i don't know what it is and the police i saw a video last night before i slept and the police was like eh, the girl showed up that according to the guy's statement that the girl showed up with a weapon and in the process of maybe when the guy was raping her the girl tried to defend herself and that made the guy upset and then he killed her in the process and i'm like somebody is dead and you are still you are still are you trying to blame the victim one are you trying to say that she was defending herself who oh, was defending herself and that was what made the guy feel that he was it was it was, it was okay to kill her and like he was just saying it as if the guy was forced to kill the girl it wasn't even it was as if eh, as you mean the girl did not defend herself she would, i was like this is what a police officer is saying in this country ah it it touched me Baje. and there was something i noticed police people if there's one thing they love to do more than anything they love to parade suspects i didn't see that guy paraded anyway <laughs> i hope truly he hasn't arrested but <laughs> if he had not been arrested i pray that the girl's blood will continue to haunt him i really we watch movies about uh, ghost hunting people i really hope in situations like this i really hope those things happen in real life because i don't see why murderers should live a happy life after killing someone i feel even going to jail even life imprisonment even hanging by death i don't think is enough for people like that and from the look of it they said when they went to where she was buried there were lots more bodies there so it has been a thing for him and some people that survived him have come out to talk so it has been a thing for him he has been raping his serial rapist his serial murderer i just pray i feel like we need we need something more i don't know he that guy needs to be st stoned to death i heard his family is in on it too him and his entire family of serial killers they all should be stoned to death i i hate i feel like people should stop saying women should do this women should do that try to do this before you mm -mm. Mm -mm. Well, I just pray that her family will be comforted and I pray that they get justice. That is my own prayer I pray that they get justice and her soul is at peace for that Please, I'm going to just end this here. I'll just say women look out for women If you're a guy and you claim you're a good guy Start looking out for women around you and ensure your guys are not stupid and if they are stupid report them Report them stand up for women. Okay, and stop saying women are overreacting because definitely they are not overreacting women don't overreact for nonsense let's make muffins <laughs> i'm using pack muffins because i've not nailed my muffin recipe and i want to see how this is going to come out it even comes with its own muffin whatever they call it that's okay That's very thoughtful. Mm. So I have a bowl here. I'm just going to pour it and it says we should add in 100 ml of water and oil and one egg. So I might double on that mixture. Shall I? I want it to be really fluffy. Oh, it comes with something else too. Ah, what is this? It comes with chocolate chips. Ooh. I always make my things from the scratch so i've never really used boxed 
cake or muffin things so this is really cute to know i like it but i can see it says bitter <laughs> i'm about the sweet life guys so i might not be using this i have like sweet chocolate chips which i will use instead and there's already chocolate chips i think inside already and he put in some extra ones but i'm not going to add this let me follow the instructions and i will be back I think I'm bringing it out. Oops. this in the in the fridge for another meal this would be like a full meal yeah so I cooked some beans in the pressure cooker earlier I'll just put it in the fridge and whenever I want to make like porridge beans I'll just cook out some here just going to make my own faster so I kind of have like half and half of a meal already this and the chicken and I'll just Put it in the fridge. I'm going to use this for maybe like barbecue chicken later on, and I'll just put this in the fridge. Yes. I need to organize my fridge, but I'm, I'm tired. I'll do it another night. <laughs> If you like to see like a curry sauce recipe, let me know. Let me know. I think I actually have. You can see it is a lot thicker. I'm going to add some more. I want it too thick. So you want too thick. I'm going to let this boil down. I think I filmed this recipe some weeks back. I have a lot of recipes filmed on my hard drive. And I have a lot of videos filmed. I just need to probably edit them. So, I don't know if this is a recipe you like to see. Let me know. And I would try my best to edit it and drop it. Okay, okay guys. So, I need to focus my focus on this food. I'll catch you guys later. I hope. <laughs> I hope this vlog turned out to be something good. I hope when I piece everything together, it will be slightly enjoyable, I guess. I hope. <laughs> if you enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like my video, and drop a comment. That's been a while I said all these things. <laughs> but please, subscribe, okay? I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.